can I delay Hajj due to an important of the wedding of the children in marriage? Well, many people had this problem of uh, of uh, having uh, thinkings that let's uh, finish this project and finish that project and let's uh, our kids uh, get married. When they grow up, they will become an elder. Let them get married. So when we get free, our business is set up, our job is being set up, and we have enough savings, then we will go to Hajj. But according to the Sunnah of the Prophet Sallallahu when you are capable of uh, financially when you are capable of uh, physically and you're capable to do hajj do it do not wait or do not delay because you don't know if you keep thinking about that because nobody knows when somebody's going to do when somebody's going to die so rather than just waiting for okay let's this finish let's finish that and let's finish this and let's finish that let the kids grow up and let them get married and let let's have a let have them their own children and let their life is being sad let's wait 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 and keep waiting for that so rather than waiting the prophet sallallahu said when you're capable for financially when you're capable for physically do that just finish that because this is something an obligatory to every muslim this is just like a basically an excuse from a shaitan who who does who stops you from do that rather a person has to keep making a dua oh yeah allah please accept my hajj oh yeah allah please accept me from hajj oh yeah allah please accept me for hajj that coming up oh yeah allah please accept my dua for hajj i want to go to hajj at least have a pure near day and to go and many uh, people who are a little old, they say, okay, I'm too old to do that. But this is something like an, just an excuse because if, if, if you'll ask them, okay, let's go to a Switzerland tour, let's go to a Europe tour, they will just like suddenly get up and go for a tour. But what is obligated by Allah, we try to push that back. That's our nafs that uh, pushes us uh, back. Even though I have seen like many, uh, mashallah, into uh, Hajj, I have seen people into the wheelchairs who are like an extremely very old at their last stages and even the extreme thing that I have I was able to see uh, the the couple is on a stature and they, they have a big uh, oxygen cylinder and here they are doing a tawa because have the help of uh, people are holding a stature and they are running and uh, making a sai and making a, a tawafi even their age because they had they like they want to do that they want to go there because it's a house of Allah and every Muslim has a wish to go there go there so who is capable who has a financial power who has a uh, who has a physical power it is a very best age to go there without waiting uh, when they get old and things go uh, more into more situation because you don't know if you grow up if, if you get in uh, more older maybe you will not be able to keep capa capable for that then you have to hire another person for a wheelchair and then you have to hire hire a people who going to be going with you on a stage so rather this is your young age and you want to go so better just do it because this is obligated to Allah and this is a um, pillar of Islam